Hi, I'm George Cow, a number one Amazon best-selling author. Now I say that with some facetiousness because it's easier than you think to become an Amazon number one bestseller. I'm going to show you right now. I just released my new book, Soul Gym, today, and I've had some of my friends and family and colleagues support the book by buying it. And I'm already number four for today's bestsellers in one hour self-help short reads just below C.S. Lewis, <laughs> the famous uh, Christian author and the one who wrote uh, the witch line, witch in a wardrobe, C.S. Lewis, that, that, that one. And also just below Dale Carnegie's How to Win Friends and Influence People, a summary of it anyway. There's my book, Soul Gym, right? So, and if you go to my books page itself, it says right now, that I am number one in new release for the one hour, uh, one hour self help short reads. So it's easy. And then you say, well, George, you must be selling thousands of copies or millions of copies. Well, let me show you the actual numbers. I'm going to my Amazon, uh, Kindle direct publishing, uh, report right now. And I have 23 units sold of this book. 23. Do you have 23 friends, colleagues, classmates, uh, family members, extended family members who might be willing to buy your book for just one dollar? Whoops. Sorry about that. Let me go back here for just one dollar. <laughs> yes, probably you do as well. And so when people tell me that they're a number one Amazon bestselling author, I'm like, okay, I don't maybe say this to them because it'd be kind of rude, but I think to myself, Hmm, for how many days were you number one? And in which, which tiny subcategory were you number one? Uh, so now you know when people say that, you, now you know how simple it is. And I just want to tell you, it was already number one release in this category earlier this morning when there were only nine orders, nine sold. All right. So now you know, and hopefully you're wiser when people tell you and use that kind of tagline for number one Amazon bestseller. Now you know, well, maybe it's not uh, what it's all hyped up to be. If they're a number one New York Times bestseller or number one Wall Street Journal bestseller, that's definitely legit. Amazon bestselling status, mm, a lot less so. So hope this helps.